yolo journalism at best a false narrative created by women activists of india supported by media houses that indian husband do force sex with wife without her consent and get scot free they never asked when wife does force sex with her husband against his will or consent do you term wife a rapist the logic given modern days marriage based on equal partnership hence wife consent and will to be respected irrespective she is married or unmarried even a married woman's right to say no to have sexual relationship has been compared equal to a sex worker the real fact india had already criminalized for sex with wife by husband and provided law like ipc 498a db act to protect a wife and punish not only husband his relatives too but the same protection has not been provided to any indian husbands forget about sex if any husband even kiss his wife without her consent not only husband his mother father sister brother also termed criminal and sent to jail on mere verbal allegations by wife no evidence record in ipc 498 in db act husband and even his old parents thrown out from their own home on mere allegations by wife that husband had forced sex with her she got protection order and then on her own testimony husband sent to jail in the name of breach of protection order in india there is a law called crpc 125 a husband asks to beg borrow or steal but have to pay even his divorced wife working wife till she alive or get remarried irrespective the breakdown of marriage due to husband or wife fault does any country all over the world such type of law exist national crime bureau report 2020 says husband suicide 73093 wife suicide only 28085 do judiciary or law makers made any effort or action plan how to reduce husband suicide in last 75 years a group of elite class man and woman desperate to term husband a rapist for their own self interest and nothing else when a wife does for sex with her husband without his consent or will they never term the wife a rapist then why consent and will of husband not respected by wife after marriage comes under any criminal law now we will understand violation of men's constitution right article 14 equal protection of every citizen in front of law irrespective of gender and article 21 live and liberty of a person with dignity now we will understand violation of men's constitution right the burning question is why men should marry to indian woman when he knows his wife when he knows his wife have a red card which she can i repeat she can use the same at any time and term him a rapist and the husband even does not have a yellow card in marriage relationship result marriage strike is the only option for common man of india till the law makers judiciary does not take corrective action 
to make modern day marriage in india through as real equal partnership and replace the word husband wife to spouse in every law related to marriage relationship जॉब नहीं मजबूरी है मैरिज लाइफ जरूरी है जॉब नहीं मजबूरी है मैरिज लाइफ जरूरी है जॉब नहीं मजबूरी है मैरिज लाइफ जरूरी है वी आर ऑन मैरिज लाइफ वी आर ऑन मैरिज लाइफ वी डिमांड पूरी नहीं होगी मैरिज लाइफ चलती रहेगी जब तक हमारी डिमांड पूरी नहीं होगी मैरिज लाइफ चलती रहेगी वी आर ऑन मैरिज लाइफ वी आर ऑन मैरिज लाइफ शॉर्ट नहीं मजबूरी है मैरिज लाइफ जरूरी है शॉर्ट नहीं मजबूरी है मैरिज लाइफ जरूरी है